Josh Axelberg would display it. And today, I'd like to show you how we create uh, printed fabric graphics for our trade show displays. Now, this is a three-step process. The first step is where we are right, right now, and this is the printing process. What we're doing here is we're printing on a uh, transfer paper material. So the image is being printed in, uh, basically in reverse so that when we run this paper through our heat transfer machine with the fabric, the ink that is on this um, paper will be chemically transferred into the fabric. So that means that it's not, we're not just printing on top of the fabric, we're printing in such a way and transferring the ink so that the inks are dyed into all of the fabric. So it means that you're going to have uh, a more durable, longer lasting um, print. This step in the process is very important for you to at least know a little bit about when you're selecting a trade show display because uh, some providers, a little bit faster or more ex inexpensive way of producing uh, fabric graphics is to print directly onto the fabric. Um, but when you do that, you don't get as durable a print, you don't get as crisp uh, uh, text on the fabric, and you don't get as vibrant a colors. So um, while it's less expensive for the provider and faster, uh, the direct print process doesn't give you uh, the kind of colors and, and vibrancy that you see with this process. So what we're going to do here is we'll finish printing onto this paper material and then we're going to take it over to our heat transfer and we'll show you that next step in the process. So after printing our um, graphic onto the transfer paper material, we've taken that roll of transfer paper and we've brought it over here to our heat press unit. And so loaded into the heat press is our printed transfer paper. That's what you see up here. And down below, we have our fabric. So the printed transfer paper and the fabric are going through the heat press at the same time. And that causes the inks inside the, uh, that are printed on the transfer paper to be transferred fully into the fabric. So it's not just on the top, it's dyed into the complete fibers of the fabric. And that gives you a long lasting print and very vibrant colors. So now we're gonna take our transferred roll over to our cutting and sewing department. Now that we've transferred our uh, paper print onto the fabric, we take that fabric roll and the first place that it comes to is our uh, CNC uh, cutting machine for fabric. So this is our roll of fabric that we transferred and it's queued up into the machine. Now when these prints are printed, we add uh, black dots around the print and a barcode so that the CNC machine knows what size to cut the fabric to. So this really assures that we're gonna get a consistent quality cut every time. The machine reads the, uh, the dots and then it cuts the uh, fabric appropriately. After the fabric is cut, it's placed into its own job bin with its job jacket and it goes to the proper sewing station to be sewn. Now,